tomorrow is the time of Sukkot, sitting in Sukkah, very important mitzvah, and you know quite well, this is the mitzvah which have to remind us about coming out from Egypt, about the clouds of glory, the arts that Israel had in the desert. And what we have tomorrow is very interesting phenomena, which really the whole world realizes it, which they call blood moon. Many of them, four clear ones, come on the festival of Jews, which is Sukkot, Pesach. Now let us see here. This is by the way interesting, the picture, but it's written here, Likoi Arei Achadom, this is a red eclipse of the moon, which will be the eve of Sukkot on the 14th of Tishrei, which is the 8th of the 10th of the 14th. Now let us see the table itself, very interesting table, which, as we will see, have a lot of interesting indications to this a clip of the moon, which is, as you said, called Blood Moon tomorrow evening when we'll be in the Sukkah. Sitting in the Sukkah, we'll see it. Now, what we have is the following. So, this is what you see here. You have here the word Likwe Yareach. Eclipses of the moon. Interesting, you have the word Adom here. So red, interesting. Likwe Adom. Now, what we have here is the following. You have here, amazingly, clearly the time, Besukot, in, in Sukkot, this is exactly tomorrow, there is a big mitzvah to see in the Sukkah. And then what you have is also very interesting, you have Mashiach, twice here, the same line, every six letters, now number six is a very meaningful number, it's the number of Yosef, of the Yesod, purity, of family life, man and woman. Amazingly, you have Mashiach, you know, one of the Mashiach, you have Mashiach ben David and ben Yosef, and here you have Bnei Yosef, amazingly, coming Bnei Yosef, Mashiach, Bnei Yosef, and we have Ben Ishai also. This is Ben Ishai, the Messiah of David, amazingly. Here you have letter after letter, this coming here. You think this is that you are now, Taf Shin A, which is 775, which is the year, very, very suitable, appropriate for Mashiach, as we saw. And it all depends on Shuvah. You can see clearly the word Teshuvah. Repentance coming here. Also very important condition for Mashiach. is keeping the Shabbat, which is written here, Yom Shabbat, Shabbat Kodesh, Yom Shvi, the seventh day. is Shabbat Kodesh, the holy Shabbat, you should keep it. And in this merit, you will have also redemption Mashiach. So as we said, very interesting table, as we have really very significant here, exactly Sukkot coming here with the moon eclipse, you have Yosef, and you have Adom, red by the way, also indicated to the moon being red, and as we said, Mashiach, Ben Ishai, Ben Yosef, and repentance, which is the most important. So really, let us hope that this is what will happen, and as we said, this year is very significant, Important here, a lot of indications that will merit, we'll have to do tshuva, repentance, Mashiach will come. And as the eclipse of the moon being exactly on this month, I mean really on this festival, which is a very important festival, we said that also is a time that can be gogo magog also. So very significant time altogether, and the year, as we said, it's very important, 775, which is really a time of Messiah. If we keep Shabbat, we keep purity of life and uh, everything we should do with the Torah, keeping the commandments. And then we'll have, we hope, in all of this year, Mashiach will come and redeem us from all our troubles.